Hi, I'm Adria from kajabiexperts.com. In this video, we're gonna see how you can migrate from your current theme to an updated theme. Kajabi said that they are just gonna update the themes for bug fixing, but if that happens, you should get your data, your settings, and your images all in the new theme. Let's go ahead and let's see how easy it is to do that. As you see here, I have the Primo site theme installed with some customizations. So if we go inside customize, you see that in the header I have my own fake logo. I also changed the this text, the background image. I added here something. So I have some stuff just to make sure my theme is customized for this demo. I'm gonna also just to show you that you can rename the theme and I'm gonna call it test theme. So whatever, imagine that you did a lot of changes to the theme and now Kajabi releases a new theme and you want to keep your, your own updated. So you want to make sure that the bug fixes, the new possible features that they can, they can add to the theme, they are also in your theme. So the first thing that we, we're gonna need is in the in our theme that we are using, we're gonna go to more and we're gonna say export zip. When we click on this option, Kajabi is gonna prepare our theme to be exportable and uh, as it says here, it's gonna send you an email. In this case, it's sending uh, an email to, to myself uh, telling me when the export is complete. I just received uh, the email as so in my phone. So uh, let's go to the email. It says your theme export is ready and it provides us with a link to download the theme. We can click on the on the link. The theme will download and we can extract the theme. Okay, let's go to the folder. And we have it here, test theme. As you see, these those are the files of your theme. Let's go back to the of your current theme. So we have here the files of your current theme. So now the next step we, we would do would be to install the new theme, the out the updated uh, theme. So we would go to pick a theme. In this case, my theme was this one, the Primo, but the same applies for the other theme. So I would get the Primo theme and hit install theme. Now uh, Kajabi will be installing the new theme for us. It can take a few seconds. And now the theme is installed. You see that we're still using the test theme, our theme. So the if someone goes inside the your site now, they will see still the, the current theme, so nothing changed. We installed the Primo site theme, and uh, that's that's supposed to be the new update theme. What we're gonna do now is we're going to export again the th as theme. So we're gonna click export theme and do the same. So remember, still our current theme is the test theme. Everything's perfect. We have the Primo site exported, installed, and exported, but nothing has changed on our site. I'm gonna go back again to the email. I see that there is a new email from Kajabi sending me the link for the other uh, theme. I'm gonna download again the, the new theme that I just installed, extract it again. So there he is, the Primo site theme. Here we have it. I'm using Mac OS, but the same should apply for Windows. So now I'm gonna open another tab here with the test theme. So as you see here we have the Primo site, that's the updated Kajabi theme, and here we have the test theme, that's our current theme. What we should do now in order to um, save our customizations, we should go into our theme, so the test theme, inside the assets, and we should copy all the things that we have changed. So, for example, in my case, I changed the header logo, the site marquee, the store static, and 
I think I didn't change anything else. In case you have doubts, you can just copy all the pictures. So you can just get all the images here and make sure you have all of them. The next thing that we will need to do is to get our settings. So like the text we changed, the settings that we enabled or disabled in our theme. Where are those settings? Well, let's go first things first. Let's do the assets first. So. Uh, now that I have selected the images that I changed, I can copy them, go to the Primo site, remember the theme that we just updated, go to Assets and paste the images here. We paste the images and we say replace the images. Now yes, let's go back to what, what I was saying, let's copy now the settings. So back again in the test theme, our current and actual theme, we go to Config, and we should copy this settings data .json, the settings data. Make sure you copy the settings data and not the settings schema. So we should copy the settings data .json, copy, go back again to the Primo site, config, and paste settings data, replacing the changes. We are we have now the data, the settings that we change in the Primo site. That's the theme that was updated. Now we are missing one last step. So we have already the assets, we have already the settings, we are ready, but they are in our computer. We need to put those settings in uh, back in the new Kachavi. So I'm going to go back to the folder. Now it's the Primo site because the test theme is the old one. We want now the new one, the Primo site, the, the one that was updated, and we're going to compress uh, the folder in a zip file. To do that, depending on the operative system that you're using, you're using Windows or Mac or Linux, it, it, it has to be done in different ways. If you don't know how to do that, just, go just Google for uh, zip a folder. So in Mac it's very easy, we just right click on the folder and we say compress. And you see that here we have the primo site.zip that I just compressed. I'm going to delete the other themes just to not make any confusion. So the zip files that I downloaded and the folders can be dele deleted. Now I have this primo site here.zip and I can come back to the um, theme, to the Kajabi and hit upload theme. Now the last thing I need to do is to drag my theme here And wait, because now Kajabi is getting the theme, it's installing the theme, and it will appear soon here. Again, we should wait some seconds for Kajabi to install the theme. Still hasn't changed anything on the site, so the users still see our test theme that we had here. Come on. This now it takes a, a while to appear so you see the active theme is the test theme nothing has changed and we just installed this one is in order uh, they are ordered they are sorted from installation so the last one that we installed this one here is the one that we have that should have our customization we can before activating it so the visitors on our site doesn't see anything strange we can go to customize to see that every all of our changes are there. As you see, there is our logo, there is our changes, the images, everything is back. So we can go back, we can even rename the theme to have it exactly the same as we had before, so I'm gonna call it test theme. Save. And now the last part is to activate the theme. So we hit activate and now we have our theme ready. The latest version released by Kajabi and with our customizations. This thing works for all the customizations being images or settings done from the customized section. If you've done any change in the code, in the theme code, you will need to manually change those things in the new files. That's the only way to do that.